Hello and good Monday, August 13th, 2007. I'm Joanne and this is Rocket Boom. First major seafaring ship arrives at the newly constructed Polish seaport in 1923. That's because the Polish Parliament passed a Seaport Construction Act almost a year prior. Thought you might like to know. So where are we now? The Life in the Fastlane.ca site has put together images and captions of some of the most unusual looking animals in the world. Do you think some of these animals are messed up? Like, something went bad that made them like that? I mean, do you think that they think we're normal, or do you think they think they're normal and it's us who's all messed up? All I know is that there are a lot of animals out there that didn't make this list, so add your picture to the comments. Or not your picture as in a picture of you, but a picture of a weird animal that's not you. In China, a quick-to-market group has manufactured an iPhone ripoff. While quite clever and possibly with a modified copy of the original OS, touch screens have been around for a long time and it would be interesting to know how it compares to the potentially more refined sensitivity of the iPhone. In Houston, all's fine and dandy looking in space this weekend after the Space Shuttle Endeavour successfully docked with the International Space Station. Seems to be a bit of foam loss from over the gas tanks, but um, nobody seems to be worried. Over Houston, Facebook, we have a problem. A weblog called Facebook Secrets with a single entry has posted the code from Facebook's homepage in a major security breach this weekend due to a server misconfiguration error. Facebook takes privacy of information very seriously because they're a major source of people's personal identity. In Germany, hacking tools against law. Now in effect, no one in Germany is allowed to possess any hacking tools including software code. Not in Germany. Any longer is this website which hosts snippets of code for programs that people use to attack routers, security sniff and engage in brute force. On the internet, you can now type in slash flash to any Rocket Boom URL to watch Rocket Boom in flash, closed caption or with translations in other languages. You can also type in slash WMV if you like Windows media files which work the same way. In Iceland, not so much. Which is where we'll leave it.